Howdy, 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 everyone. Have a fantastic, fantastic day. We are at Le Garage here in Austin, Texas, at the Palmer Event Center, where we are going to go to probably the fanciest garage sale you'll ever be in. And we're going to look at a bunch of clothes and hopefully some fun stuff to buy. We have some trips coming up, concerts coming up, so maybe we'll find something interesting for those. Glad you're here. Let's head on in. So we're here at the Palmer Event Center and they also have a woodworking shop going on today also. So uh, that's pretty cool. It is, again, very warm out and we've been trying to find things to do that are not, not heat related. So oh, being inside, know. being inside is nice. That's right, I, don't, I wanna be inside. So we've been trying to find things to do that are indoors and not outdoors. Um, this is not usually my forte of thing to do as a garage sale. But it is indoors, and I'm hoping that I get to eat some tacos after this downtown here in Austin. You know, Austin has really good tacos, so we're going to be hopefully hitting up a taco place after this. You can also see while Lay Garage is going on, we also have the Texas Woodworking Festival. All kinds of stuff going on at Palmer Event Center. So, usually something every month. Look at this, y'all, the Lay Gar Garage. It's pretty cool. And all your favorite boutiques and brands on sale under one roof. So here we are. We made it. We are indoors. You can see this is the whole setup here. It literally looks like it's all closed, which is not going to be cool for me. Because uh, I was hoping that there would be a boys section. But there doesn't look like there's a boys section. Tina's telling me about uh, how things start becoming on sale on the second day. You can see we, we have stuff that's 70% off. It was 165, now 45, and now it's down to 30. So if you do come on the second day, you might get some deals. You might get some really good deals. This is only two days. It's Saturday and Sunday. How much was it? How much did it cost to get in here? Ten dollars to get in. Are those Converse's? No, they're, so it's, they're supposed to look like a rather expensive shoe. It's kind of the knockoff brand. Oh, so knockoff brand of a Converse? No, not a Converse. Whatever. I don't remember the expensive shoe. What is it called? They're like $300, but they look like they're dirty. Uh, well, this one started at, what is that, $60? Or yeah. it started at $94, and then went down to $60, and now it's $49. So they're knocking prices down. Is these tigers? Is these? Yeah, they're tigers. Yeah, they, they look like tigers, yeah. Tigers. $64. That's adorable. That's really cute. Oh, and I love it when it goes back in front. Oh, look at that one. Yeah, cute. We got, got some kitty cats there? Oh, look how cute they are. I like that. What, is, what does it say on them? Girl power and the future is feline. And, and, and that's a taco. taco and a hot sauce. Look. That's cute. How much are they? 30, $20. 20 bucks, man. That's, that's a deal. Fancy, isn't it? That's the most country looking outfit I've seen in my life. How much is it? We need it, don't we? I don't know. We need to wear that so we can Where is the hat? show everybody that we're from Texas. I don't know. I don't see it tag. Oh, there it is. It is. You just turned it over. $98. $98? But I think it's 50% off, so yeah. 50 bucks. It's kind of cool here because you're getting boutiques from all over the area. So uh, they're just all in one big room for you. They bring in their merchandise and... Uh, you can buy whatever you want here. Look at this little drink cart coming here. We got some beers. That's fun. Yeah, that is fun. Beers and wines. What do we got here? We got Bud Light. I like that a lot. We got all kinds of shoes here. 60% off. Look at all these shoes. Tina, Tina is digging those. I don't know what she said to them, but they laughed about it. I have these in almost every color except that one. Oh, I got you. My I just want to touch goodness, you. those are big. What is that, big, velvet? What is that? Yeah, that is. Those are huge. 50 bucks. Oh, no. Oh, so this one's... Four thirty-five. But they're half off now, though. 60% off. I don't know. They do have boy stuff here, as you can see, uh, but not a very extensive area. 
it's really jamming in here, I tell you. We got Selena Gomez right now going on. We got some hats here. These are all bags. The boys area consists of all bags. Yeah. I do like the luggage here. 125, which is pretty basic. That's, that's pretty much in line with like Ross and stuff. These are 195. And price has been coming down, you can see. Oh yeah. And that one looks more like little Look at that. Dummy got some steaks. She works at a school where the mascot is pythons. And they were five bucks. Those are cute. Look how cute these are, my goodness. All kinds of little animals. You got Winnie the Pooh, Piglet, and Tigger. Look how cute, 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 cute. Tatina would like this tiger. He's 40 bucks. He's really cute. We got Mario and Luigi there. They are both 40 bucks. Or no, they're 25 bucks. Here is Woody and Jesse. Here is Sonic. Look at him. Isn't he cute too? Eeyore and Piglet. We got a Hello Kitty. Now, that is cute. Queso Queen. It's got queso on the back of it. That is unbelievable. How much is that? 169. 169. Wow. Wow. So actually, that shirt was 50% off, so it's actually $85 for the queso shirt. These are really cute here. All your schools, they got my bears. They got Sikkims. They got Sikkims. They got bears. They got Bama. They got a Texas. They got Texas A&M. Look how cute that is. But we all know that the Baylor Bears is the best. So we also got some Horn Frogs. UT, we got the Tigers, we got the Razorbacks, look at all these. Fancy, very fancy. Look at that. How much are these? 50 and 40. 50 and 40? Got a bunch of uh, different hats here for you. Look at this. You want a nicely priced hat? You can definitely find one here. I found another men's section here. Look at this. This is all men's clothes. We got all these nice uh, flannel jackets. We're going to Alaska in the near future. These would be nice to wear there. That green one, that's a sweater. Vest? Yes. A little sweater vest. I like that. Look at all these. Look at these. Ooh. Feel that. Look at that. Ooh, that. What is that, velvet? What is that, velvet? That's nice. And I think that one might make me itch a little bit. You think? Yeah, it's kind of scraggly. The, the insides of these are, are fun because they're like fuzzy. Yeah. So everything you just saw on this rack is $50. Not bad. We also have some uh, candles here. Look at this. Anywhere between $15 and $35. Lots of candles. These things usually look like for, yep, more candles. Natural soy wax. Look at that. I found a Mickey shirt. Walt Disney World. Vintage. Oh my goodness. Florida Mickey. He's all decked out in his America gear. How much is that? Forty-two dollars. Wow. Cayenne, rosemary sea salt, dark chocolate sea salt, and for the fall, the pumpkin spice. Can I try the uh, spicy cayenne? Yes. Because that's probably what I'm gonna buy. We make it here every Sunday and Monday. So this week we'll be making it Monday and Tuesday. That is really good. Spicy cayenne. Wow, this one's good. Okay, well. I'll take this one. Well, I got the uh, spicy cayenne. It is like 20 bucks a bag, so it's pretty expensive. $20 a bag. If you need a uh, step for your dog to get up on the couch, we have that. Look at that. Coco uses her still. We also have some, uh, we have some Coco clothes. Nice winter jackets. We got doggy toys also. Look at this. For your go-go. Oh my goodness. That's a that's a cute one. Look at all the cutting boards they have here. These are really cool. We got Willie for President cutting board. We got Stubbs. Barbecue, I like that. We have an Austin, Texas cutting board. Keep Austin weird. These are really cool. I love tacos so much. This is a dance floor, keep, it, keep on dancing. Tina would like that. And look at all the coasters here, all Austin, Texas themed. I love it. Well, 
like that deep Eddie Vodka one back there. Look at that. Lick is absolutely delicious. There's an ice cream place here. That's really cool. It's got a Kirby Lane, Alamo Draft House, Austin Gallery, and you can see their pushers are five each or four for ten. And the cutting boards are ten each or three for twenty-five. Look at those fancy sunglasses. Gabby, those are a must-have. I don't know where you will wear them, but they're cute. See you Show me that. It's $68. $68 for New Kids on the Block shirt. <laughs> That's Tina's favorite boy band. We even have some furniture here. Look at this. Chairs that were $1,200 for the pair. Now they're down to $500. Kind of antique -y stuff here. Got a desk that's already been sold. It's a wicker desk. I don't like wicker that much. We got a planter's tray. It's a big planter's tray. It was 228, now it's 100 bucks. We have a we have a yoga supply place here. It's called Karma Carmadillo. You can get your little pat, your mats. Get a hat over there. Belt bracelets. That's interesting. $25 for each one. Oh, look at the Mickey shirt. I love that. How much is it? $15. That's not bad. $15 for a t-shirt. He's really cute. It's kind of cool. They got these little pictures. They have little things on them. This one's for a teacher. This one is if you have grit. This one's about the highs and lows of life. And that one's for your mom. Tina's going to get this for her carnival cruise with the new kids on the block, party night. It's very sparkly. It is, I like it. Alrighty, y'all, so there you have it. How much fun was that? Uh, you can get some really good prices in there, especially if you come on Sunday. Sunday's the day to go because everything's marked down. Um, so if you're making a mad rush on Saturday to Lake Garage, they probably will have stuff picked over, but you'll get some really good deals on the second day. Now we're going to head to eat some Austin tacos. Alrighty, today's lunch is going to be at Fresca's. It is a chicken al caban taco joint. It's right down here on South First Street. And uh, this is your typical Austin bougie tacos. That's what we're going with should be yummy Alrighty, so we're eating outside they said the earliest we could get inside would be two o'clock right now it's one o'clock so we decided we're gonna eat outside it is pretty warm out here but we do have fans blowing on us so that is nice so uh after talking to the gentleman he said the wings are very good and he said the food style here is modern mexican Alrighty, y'all so we have all kinds of tacos here you see we got the uh la fresa which is a chicken taco with guacamole cabbage grilled onion we got a El Rey, which is a slow-cooked beef brisket and cabbage. Then we have another chicken taco, the El Santo, and the La Marie. That's a shrimp avocado. But I think I'm leaning towards the wings. I wanted a taco, but the, the gentleman's trying to tell me the wings here are good. And I'm going to be the judge of that. I don't, I'm not going to trust what anyone else says. And then I might get the Mexican street corn, but just because I like Mexican street corn. Look at this, y'all. The straw changes colors. That's fancy. I'm saving that. Can do it? Oh yeah, Gabby, thank you there, Gabby. So we, I can get a good a good photo here. <gasps> nothing has happened yet, and nothing's still happening. I think it's just, oh, it did, it changed to, oh, fancy. Man, that queso is delicious. It is creamy, it is fresh. You can taste the uh, chorizo in it. Um, hint of salsa, that is good queso. This queso is so good, you could almost eat it without chips. It's got so much chorizo in it. It's got such a good flavor. Just the right amount of spice. So here is my wings. Look how they are definitely grilled wings. No question about that. Got poblano ranch dressing there and some kind of hot sauce. There is my Mexican street corn. Looks absolutely delicious. Dami's got the fresa tacos, chicken. They look absolutely yummy. And she got a bowl of beans. Tina, what is yours? A bowl of what? bowl of chicken and rice and beans and the lettuce, a little bit of everything. And that's 
It's pretty much what Gabby got also. No, I got no, salad. salad. Oh, she got a salad. Is there any meat protein in that? Yeah, chicken. Good. The wings are very good. I'm actually very surprised. Uh, they have a very sweet taste to them. You can definitely tell they're grilled. There's no batter on them. So I would think that they would be healthier because there is no batter on them. But uh, I would definitely get them again. The Plabano sauce is very good, the ranch dressing. Um, and then the carrots and the celery have some like salt, sweet spice on it. Salty, sweetie spice. It's interesting. Mexican street corn is delicious, spicy. Got that creamy mayonnaise, whatever that spice is. If you've had um, Mexican street corn, you know what I'm talking about. A hint of citrus in it. It's really good. Highly recommend the Mexican street corn. So everything here is electronic, so I don't have a receipt, but I'll tell you the price. It was $104 with a $25 tip. So it ended up being 125 bucks. It actually ends up being two meals for us. We'll have the leftovers tonight for dinner. So not, not as expensive as it seems, but it's really good food. I would highly recommend this this uh i didn't realize my glasses were <laughs> i saw cricket on my head uh really good food i uh, really enjoyed it well, and probably will enjoy it again tonight that's true what you want to sit inside you gotta reserve early yeah if you're going to sit inside gabby wants me to tell you you must reserve early because it is uh it seems like there's a pretty big way to get in and here's the inside look how cute this is nice and cool in here very clean fresh look very modern very nice. They got a little bar over there with a little Modelo on tap. Alrighty, y'all. So that'll wrap the day up. I'm here actually at HEB right now getting my food, uh, waiting for them to bring it out. I hope you enjoyed this video. We had a lot of fun at Le, Le Garage. Awesome place to go visit many boutiques. Uh, and then at uh, Fresa's where we uh, had, had some good wings, some good tacos. Um, and the girls had really good salads. So um, yeah, what a great day. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a big thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. You know, we love you guys. The Prom Free, we'll see you next time. Bye.